What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back. Drop 10k in the comments, like the vid, 100 likes, give away 10k to a guy in the comments, $10 PSN. It's that simple. Like the vid, 100 likes, baby. We've done it before. We've hit 150 before. We've hit 130 before. What makes you think we won't do it again? Guys, I'm thinking about streaming. Listen, this might sound insane. But honestly, it's Father's Day. I do not feel like playing MLB. I do not feel like rage quitting. I'm probably going to be streaming Fortnite. Listen, if you do not want to come out, I don't care. I'm just going to do something fun, something different. I want to stream Fortnite. I need to get Twitch hours anyways. And honestly, I'm really going to have Fortnite. If you want to pop up, we'll still talk MLB. I don't care. I just don't feel like playing the game right now. I lost mad games. I'm super upset. I want to stay away from it until tomorrow at least. So yeah, guys, um, we're going to get into a market overview. I will probably be streaming Fortnite with my bro. He's literally a god. He has like 2,000 wins. He's insane. But yeah, guys, let's get into this market overview. So as per usual, I drop market overview. We're probably going to drop a budget squad vid very soon. I have a gameplay recorded. I got to edit it still. But yeah. Okay, guys. So today is a day where the market is looking a little awkward and weird and i'm gonna go over it let's get over to the live cards look let's look at chris bryant's price um so chris bryant has not moved okay this is what i'm thinking so right now the market is looking like it's at a stand it's looking like it's literally the same as yesterday so pretty much what I'm just going to recommend you to do right now, it's either going to go up or down. And I'm pretty sure the stub sale is valid till the 17th, which is tomorrow. So if it's to the 17th till tomorrow, you're, the market's either going to go down or up. But so now next week, let's look at what they're dropping and let's see what's going on. And I'm going to give you my perfect opinion on what we should do and how you're gonna make stubs so we got mills review fourth inning program all right we already did all this let's see um i'm gonna move the face cam because i cannot see anything um wrong thing okay three all-star events that's blousy fourth inning content um no one cares so okay it says nothing about a stub sale so that's good so the stub sale is gonna be gone you'll probably see prices start to drop and this is what's going to happen on friday next week there's going to be no roster update there's going to be the moments players and there's going to be headliner packs with that said with headliner packs coming out and no stub sale the market should literally die okay next week this is the time to start preparing for next week first off all i want to tell you guys go pick up charlie blackman right now he has i think freaking four multi-hit games in a row or something like I i'm gonna read you the stats okay he already went up 500 stubs i've been telling you guys to buy him a while ago because i know he's a stud listen to these stats over the last one two three four five games ready three for four a dinger and a double and a single on june 10th on june 11th uh a three-run homer and a double on june 13th two dingers a triple a single oh my goodness four rbis oh my god jo june 14th four hits a dinger a double and an rbi um june 15th june 15th four for six three singles two doubles holy crap um that's not that's crazy two rbis over the last week he's 18 for 34 with five dingers 12 ribbies two doubles eight singles and a triple um if that doesn't scream like an investment right now um i don't know what i don't know what to say um that's screaming of investment next up bro trey turner holy crap if you guys got him you're liddy trey turner is gonna go diamond next roster update and let's let me tell you why so first off we're picking up more trey turners he's still stupid cheap trey turner over the last week everybody's been sleeping 11 for 25 two homers two triples three doubles four singles 11 for 25 is insane average uh way over what is it 400 um four rbis two stolen bases three walks versus six k's seven extra base hits um go pick him up those are those two investments that i really really want to talk about let's see if there's any others that we could do before we get into this auction grind um let's see all players so Freeman, Dow. Dow's actually doing really good. David Dow's doing really good. Otani hit for the cycle. 
Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And Kingery on the Phillies is doing really good. Let's check his price. Um, will he keep it up? I don't know, but he should get an upgrade. What is he? He's a bronze. Okay. But he's expensive. So stay away from that card. But anyways, guys. So right now with the auction, I told you guys to sell your diamonds. Um, do I... Okay. Right now. This is what I'm saying. Right now. First off, if you did the fourth inning collection, you took a fat L. Um, I'm sorry. I literally... I made a video on it saying, is it worth it? I literally knew from the start it wasn't. Okay. So this is what I'm thinking. So, if you guys play Madden or 2K, when you do these collections, you usually lose stubs and get a better team. But in this case, this is why I'm pissed. Because Roberto Alomar is 100K, Verlander is 100K, Rick Henderson is 100K. This is the problem I'm seeing, okay? With Ricky Henderson being 100K, I'm honestly the same... Okay, I play with all these cards. I play with Alomar, I play with Henderson, I play with Verlander. The only one I see worth it in this whole thing is Verlander, and I know people are going to disagree, but listen, Roberto Alomar versus Joe Morgan, okay, Joe Morgan 99, he's free number one, he's not 100k, so if you have Joe Morgan already, this Alomar is pointless, you know why he's pointless, he has no secondary positions, yes he has better stats, yes he's a switch hitter, but to be honest, I played with him, I probably played 15 games with him. And Roberto Alomar is, it did worse than Joe Morgan. I don't know how it's possible, but, I mean, I'm bad at the game. So, he's decent, I mean. But, like, if you have Joe Morgan, it's not worth it. And this. Okay, Ricky Henderson. Yeah, it's Ricky Henderson. Everybody loves him. I played with him. He had no dingers. His power is fraudulent. He's a contact hitter. Listen to me. He's going to get on base. He's going to steal bases. Do you need him? No. You have Ichiro. Almost every person in the game has either Ichiro or Kemp. They have a 93 overall, 90 overall, whatever it is. Listen, their stats are very similar, and they play very well. Personally, Matt Kemp is one of my best players. He's batting 350. Ichiro is batting over 400 for me. Do I need this Ricky Henderson card? No. Do I want to keep my stubs? Yes. So doing this collection, in my opinion, was awful. If you didn't do it in the first day, which a lot of people didn't, you're going to lose over 100,000 stubs. This collection, the fourth inning collection, was probably one of the worst, the biggest L's ever. Now, with all these collections, the fifth inning collection is going to be shot. You're going to probably lose 200k stubs. They're going to keep going up in value and everyone's going to get screwed. So with everyone having a 99 overall team in a month, this game is going to die. Um, literally in a month. I mean, you could disagree, but when everybody has a 99 overall team and you're decent at the game and you're versing a good player, you're going to lose. Um, the fact that they're dropping 99s and you're going to lose stubs off 99s, this collection is unbelievably irrelevant. Um, do not do it. Just, if you want to do it, just do it legitly. Do not do the voucher. It is just stay away. And okay. That's all I'm going to say. You could disagree. I don't care. That is just my rant on this game right now. This collection is terrible and everybody's having 99 overalls in a month. So yeah. With that said right now, market overview We're I'm just talking about the auction. I'm talking about the fourth inning collection. And what I'm noticing is. I already, I already told you. Okay, so now if you have Lou Brock, wait on him. He'll rise. Um, everybody's expensive because of the stub sale. If you have cards, I'm going to say it again. Go ahead and sell them. Besides your investments, Trey Turner, keep. Blackman, keep. Okuna, keep. All the guys, you'll see you have Vlad Jr., McCann, Jones, all the 96s, 95s, 90s, pretty much all the high diamonds, just go ahead and sell. You're not going to see them at this price ever, ever again. It is a stub sale. Everybody bought the top cards because they bought stubs. So think about it, bro. When you buy stubs, do you buy investments? Hell no. You're going to buy a ton of studs. You're going to buy the Vlad Daddies. You're going to buy the Ed Eddie Murray's. You're going to buy Vlad Jr. You're going to buy Felix. So what makes you think they're going to go buy gold cards? No. That's why the gold cards are cheap. That's why the diamonds are expensive. So if you listen to bugs, you make stubs just by selling your diamonds now. Um... If you have the third inning collection complete, you're taking an L. If you have, um, if you did not sell your cards like I told you to, Verlander, Henderson, and whatever, don't sell them yet. Hold on to them. Wait about, well, I would say five days. Sell them when they're expensive. You're valid. You make a ton of stubs. So overview once again, you sell your diamonds. They're way too high. Besides your investment diamonds like Chris Bryant, I'm holding on to mine. I think he's going to go off. Things going to go to 30K. So... Sell your trout, sell your yellowches, sell all those players. You'll make stubs. Wait till Henderson goes to at least 110. You'll make stubs. Do not do the fourth inning collection. You will lose stubs. 
that is all I got for you. Hope you enjoyed. We're probably going to be streaming Fortnite. It sounds crazy. Just drop 10K in the comments. We're going to have a good day. Happy Father's Day to all you. Uh, that's all I got, man. Hope you enjoyed. 